morning everyone. I am Anirudh. I am the team leader of this project. I am Sindhu Priya and in this project my role is budget analyst. My name is Anurag. In this project my, my role is project manager. I am Anusha. In this project my role is resource management. I am P. Vaishnavi. In this project my role is model uh, Our project name is Size Based Food Sorting Machine. The faculty mentors are Sir H. O. D. Uh, Suresh Ram sir, Venkateshwar Rao sir, as assistant professor, Raman Kumar sir, assistant professor, lab assistant Praveen Kumar sir, and the components required in our project are Arduino you know, MG3 servo and color sensor. Connections are initially Arduino is connected to two servo meters and one color sensor. The connections are given in such a way that the, col uh, the color sensor detects two types of colors, which is one is green color and another is red color. Green means unripened and red means ripened. So the connection given to the top servo motor is to continuously push the foods and the connections given to the bottom servo is to open or close the door according to the ripened condition. This project is sorting the fruits according to their sizes as well as their ripened conditions. So when we take the red color fruit, it is the ripened fruits. So when it is put in the funnel, it is sorted according to the size. So when we put, when we put the unripened fruit, which is in green color, the door gets opened and it falls into the first tray. So in this way, we can sort the fruits according to their ripened conditions. So when we put the different sizes of the fruits, for example, we, put, we are putting a small fruit. It falls into the first second tray, and when we put the medium sized fruit, it falls into the second tray. So in this way, we can sort the fruits by different sizes as well as different ripened conditions. faced in our project are with the color sensor. It couldn't detect uh, the color of the uh, fruit precisely due to the surrounding light. So what we did was uh, we attached the uh, foam boards uh, to it uh, around it so that uh, the surrounding light is reduced and it can uh, read the color of the uh, fruit uh, precisely. This is how we uh, made our uh, project perfect. By completing this project, we conclude by saying that the objective of this project was to develop a quality controls and the process optimization uh, based on the sorting the fruits according to the sizes of ripened and unripened. This developed project has proven simple, efficient and user friendly. This project is cost is around 2500. Thank you.